to that dad guy. It's October the 19th, 2023, and Canada Post has issued a new stamp, so I wanted to talk a little bit about the stamp. Uh, I'll show you the booklet. I'll read the little blurb that Canada Post wrote on the back to explain the stamp. But before I get to that, I want to talk about the history of the person. And uh, he happens to be a New Brunswicker. So that is exciting that there is uh, someone who is from here that has... Uh, go on to uh, make an impact worldwide. You probably will recognize his face. You will recognize some of the films and movies he's been into because he's a quite a famous actor. Um, if you don't know his early stuff, you might know his later stuff or vice versa. Or maybe you never even knew he was in that movie. We're going to throw up some pictures of him here as well. And uh, I'll talk about the different uh, movies and films that he was, or movies and uh, TV shows that he was in and uh yeah i think that's exciting he was born in 1935 in saint john new brunswick and who i'm talking about is donald sutherland do you know the name well you should i think uh 1935 he was born in saint john new brunswick like i said and uh, he had his teenage years in bridgewater nova scotia where he finished high school then he went on to the university of victoria in uh, British Columbia, which is kind of a subsidiary university of the University of Toronto, and uh, he studied engineering and drama. But in 1957, subsequently a year after his mother passed away, at the age of 23, um, 22, sorry, <laughs> he went off to uh, England. He decided that he wanted to be an actor, so he decided he would go to London and he would go to drama school there. Uh, yeah, so that's where he kind of gave up on becoming an engineering, and then uh, he went off to, to Britain for a while at the London Academy of Music and Dramatic Arts, where he started getting his first roles. He stayed there until 1968, after he'd done a few movies like the movie Dirty Dozen. Uh, he went to Hollywood, decided he was going to go to the United States, make his career there, and went on to be in roles like M.A.S.H., which... Uh, is my favorite TV show, one of my favorite TV shows anyways, and uh, he did the movie adaptation of the movie. He played the main character of Hawkeye Pierce, uh, very different than the one that uh, Alan Alda played in the television show, but still became very iconic. Uh, he went on to uh, have uh, three marriages during that period of time between uh, the 60s and 1972, a uh, number of children, including Kiefer Sutherland, which you may know. Uh, he's been in a number of films as well as an actor, including the television show 24. Uh, other things that uh, he was in during the 70s were things like uh, National Lampoon's Animal House, uh, The Re Invasion of the Body Snatchers. Just go, They go on and on. Into the, the 70s and, and the 90s, he continued to make... Uh, more and more movies. Uh, he was in modern day movies such as The Hunger Games. You might know him in that if you're someone a little bit more modern. Uh, things like Space Cowboys. Yeah, I'm just going to read through a few. He was in Dirty Dozen in 1967. That was while he was in the UK. Then he came to the United States. He was in MASH. He was in Kelly's Heroes. Clute, where he met Jane Fonda and they had a be brief uh, romantic affair. He went on to do... Uh, uh, don't Look Now, um, National Lampoon's Animal House, Invasions of the Body Snatchers, Ordinary People, Eye of the Needle, uh, JFK, Backdraft, Buffy the Vampire Slayer, The Movie, Six Degrees of Separation, Outbreak, Outbreak <laughs> Time to Kill, Space Cowboys, The Art of War, The Italian Job, Pride and Prejudice, Lord of War, Fool's Gold, The Eagle, Horrible Bosses, All the Hunger Game movies, um, American Hangman, Burnt Orange History, Backtrack 2, and then TV shows. He was in The Saint in 1966 while he was in the UK. He was in The Avengers while he was in the UK. Uh, he went on to go to be into uh, Citizen X, The Big Heist, The Uprising, Commander-in-Chief, uh, Dirty Sexy Money, uh, Trust, and The Undoing. So wow, a lot of different films he's been in. And uh, I've shown you a few pictures over the time that uh, he was there, too, in those movies. Huge impact. Now let's get to the stamp. So, first of all, we have this nice 
booklet. There's 10 stamps inside. The P designation means they're a um, domestic rate valued stamp. And now let's open it up and see what it looks like. So here we kind of have a uh, Alfred Hitchcock type profile picture inside the body of his jacket. Show a number of the films, including the Italian Job and, Hu and Hunger Games there. Um, so on the back it says, over his 70 year career, Donald Sutherland, who was born in 1935 in St. John, New Brunswick, has earned a reputation as a distinctive and versatile actor. His portrayals in nearly 200 films and television productions include everything from the wisecracking Captain Hawkeye Pierce in MASH in 1970 to the villainous President Snow in the Hunger Games franchise from 2012 to 2015. His work has garnered him such awards as a Genie, an Emmy, and a Governor General's Performing Arts Award for Lifetime Artistic Achievement. Sutherland is a Companion of the Order of Canada, which he got in 2012. So those nice booklets, I got two of them. You can see the 10 stamps that are inside each booklet. I don't know. It's a pretty cool looking stamp. I like the fact that it is elongated stamp too, which is a little bit, so it's narrow. Um, it's going to be a nice addition to people's uh, postcards when I send them out. So yeah, Donald Sutherland, a New Brunswick boy, makes good. He goes off and has a successful career at the age of 88. He's still going and um, so proud of his achievements and uh, he is also an anti-war uh, activist which he's done throughout his career um, through the 60s and the 70s and, and continues to be an advocate for peace. So thank you Canada Post for the new Donald Sutherland stamp and uh, best wishes out to Donald Sutherland because I know you're probably watching. I know he watches too. I'm sure he does. Doesn't he? Really? Donald, are you watching? Maybe. Anyways, till the next video, have a magical week. Like, follow? You say like, subscribe, share, and tell all your friends. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy?